I'm Chicano and today I'm bringing you guys to the biggest mall in all of Valencia. You guys know me, man. I love my mall walking. So I'm about to show you guys what Valencia got. Mickey D's, like always. American influence, like always. Right there, Foster's Hollywood. American influence is worldwide. And this place is called, as you can see, Bon Air. It is a hot and beautiful day here in Valencia. We are in October. October was the first time. malls that I've seen in a while and I was in Istanbul not too long ago the place is known for malls that up there is Cien Montaditos that is like a, a national treasure here in Spain you get everything for a euro on certain days and on the days that you don't get them for a euro you get them for about 150 to 3 euros so definitely is a, a spot worth checking out. You guys are ever in uh, Valencia, they're everywhere. We even have one in Ibiza, so. Calcedonia, never heard of that. And this is a, it's an outdoor mall mixed with an indoor mall, which is pretty cool. We're doing the outdoor obviously right now. Al Campo, I wonder what that is. First time I've seen that. What do you think Al Campo is? I know, I was thinking like a farmer's market. Because yeah. Al Campo sounds like, True. you know, from the countryside. True. Beautiful. American influence with the Foot Locker. Bershika. Well, there's FNAC or what? What would be the, uh, the equivalent um, back in the States? Okay. The Target and Best Buy. Target and Best Buy of Spain. these right now kind of lame they're gonna upgrade 
Our deer are pretty good. Al Campo. Let me see what this Al Campo is about. I said it was like a a farmer's market. She said it was more like Walmart. So, and both of us know nothing about it. So we shall see. Sprinting. I think I think he won. Very Walmartish. So there it is. First time in one of these. The Walmart of Spain, Al Campo. There you go. They have tons of vitamins. They have an area here with we got vitamins, supplements. Look at that. This is the Walmart of uh, Spain, Al Campo. First time here, and I've been and I've been going to Spain since 2014. Been living here for a year. Pretty cool. One thing I can't find here in the states, which um, it sucks, because those, those of you guys that live, you'll know what I'm talking about immediately. Is DHEA cannot find DHEA right here, and that sucks because that's a good supplement to take if you like lifting. bunch of organic stuff and this is a very proud region of Spain as you can see from the Valencian flags being flown no Spanish flags being flown here Valencian flags yes that's one thing that a lot of you guys may not know about Spain it is a country divided sorry about that Yeah, like I was saying, um, they are uh, they pride themselves in being Catalan, for example, Valencian here. They'll fly their flags instead of the Spanish flag. So they speak a different language. I know you guys thought, oh, Spain, everyone speaks Spanish. Well, it's not even a different dialect. Um, it's not even a different uh, accent. It's a totally different language, like Catalan and Valencian. And, so yeah something unique about spain and as you can see look at all these flags those are all valencian flags no spanish flags being flown here and i want you guys to notice something here about spain how the ice cream i don't know if you guys can see it 671 there's a better view right there is more than the actual food look there's a full-on macro counted food and it's more expensive it's the same in Ibiza too, it's all over Spain. And I think that's why maybe Spanish, Spaniards are so thin, you know, because uh, sweets are high. They are very high in um, price. So, but yeah, look at all this other healthy stuff that is. Protein Muscelli, this stuff right here is great. Food court. This too is massive. Look at this unique looking name or sounder name. Muerte de la pasta, which means bite the pasta. This is a good way to see the size, the massive size of this place. Enormous. That place is I. That place is I. So 
some more of that American influence right there. <laughs> scene out there where you watch movies that's the Cien Montaditos that I was telling you guys about these are all the restaurants Have we seen a movie yet in uh, Spain? Oh yeah, we did High in Ibiza. What's playing right now? Monja, ay, no, looks scary. Golpe a Wall Street. I don't know, maybe, huh? Might check this out. This one's also very popular here. And this is the first time that I've seen a Popeyes in Spain. So. Like a, yeah. Like a round one type place. Yeah. Pure cuisine, Asian, healthy food. This sounds good. I could work with that. Huh, what is that? I've yet to find orange chicken in Spain, guys. And I'm super frustrated. Or uh, pork, barbecue pork. Can't find that either. Super American. Now we saw American over there, and this is super American right here. This is my, this is my jam. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 everything. This is what I like. And as you can see, I'm flying the American flag right there, proudly. Or American logo, I should say. Might creep up in here a little bit. I also have a big bowling alley here. Check it out. And some bowling. So there you have it guys. Hopefully you guys enjoyed that. Uh, we're about to stay here and then go catch a movie. Stay tuned for more.